morning, happy Tuesday. It's a new month and let's make it a great month. So today I have a homemade Starbucks coffee recipe that is four total carbohydrates for this whole cup of delicious Starbucks coffee. The first thing I'm going to use is Perfect Keto Cinnamon Toast Collagen. This is great for your hair, skin, nails, and your joints. It's good for mental performance and cognitive support to support energy levels, and it's good for after exercise to support healthy joints. I'm not going to exercise, so I am still going to use this. So, so the first thing I'm going to put into my Starbucks tumbler that I got at a Tarbucks Starbucks for $3. This is reusable. I use it in the top rack of my dishwasher and it washes up beautifully and no jam damaging. This is 24 fluid ounces. So the first thing I'm gonna put in is 12 ounces of the blonde roasted unsweetened Starbucks iced coffee. The nutrition facts on this for 12 fluid ounces is 10 calories, two carbs, and one protein. It's right here if you would like to see. So I'm just gonna shake it up a little bit. I have my measuring cup right here that has ounces. Okay, so 12 ounces. It's a little, little above. So 12 ounces on a Starbucks cup is almost to the last line there if you want to measure it that way. Then I'm going to add, let's add the collagen. So I only use half a scoop twice a day. So for one scoop, the nutrition facts are 80 calories, 3.5 fat, and 9 protein. So it's good for low carb. It's lower on the fat, which is awesome. So where's my, where's my scooper? Oh, because I dropped the collagen at the beginning. So it smells and tastes like Cinnamon Toast Crunch, so I'm only going to use half a scoop. This is what it looks like inside. So I'm going to add that into my cup here. Half a scoop. So only one carb count for that. So, so far we've got two for the coffee, one for the half scoop of collagen. I'm going to take a milk frother because as you can see, it is very clumpy because of the powder. So this is gonna help get all of my clumps out. And now you can even see the color of it has changed. I'm gonna froth another second or so. These little frothers are so awesome for mixing powders and liquids together. So then I have some Walmart brand unsweetened almond milk. The nutrition facts for this for one cup is 30 calories, 2.5 fat, and one carb with less than one dietary fiber. I'm only going to use half of a cup of the unsweetened almond milk, so I'm not even going to count the carb. So it's half a cup and then it has less than one um, dietary fiber, which if you're counting net carbs, that's how you would um, figure out your net carbs. You subtract your dietary fiber and your sugar alcohol, um, but for total carbs, you would just count the carbs. But we're not using a full cup, so I'm not even going to count it. If you want to count it, the total is four carbs, or if you want to use the full cup of milk, your total would be four or three. Okay, so I'm just gonna froth it again, get my milk all um, mixed around in there. And then I'm gonna top it off with ice. And then I have a delicious, homemade, inexpensive, healthy Starbucks drink. I feel like I went to Starbucks and I didn't even leave my kitchen. And all I did today was brush my teeth, and put on some deodorant. <laughs> I hope everybody has a great day. Another little tip that I do daily following a low-carb lifestyle is water intake. So I have 
one for my coffee and I'll add ice throughout the day. I'll let the ice kind of melt and then um, that way I get more mileage out of my awesome coffee. But I also have one for strictly water. This helps me follow my water intake. We should all be drinking half our body weight in ounces of water. I know it seems like a lot. So this is 24 fluid ounces. Drinking through a straw makes water intake so much easier. And when you're drinking out of a cup that you love, makes it even more easy. So I strive for a couple times a week to drink my whole body weight in ounces of water because it is amazing um, what the scale looks like after I've done that. But definitely half of our body weight in ounces of water. If you can strive for your full body weight in ounces of water, even better. So if everybody has a great day, Thank you for watching and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.